So our learning approach that we do here at CCC in Prep is our Walker Learning Approach. The way it works is it's a very authentic and exciting pedagogy that captivates the minds of our little learners um, by bringing the learning back to them and that they are the ones who are leading their learning and us as teachers, we are guiding them along the way. Um, so to how it works is we go off what the kids are interested in and what they're engaged in around the room and as teachers, we bring that learning um, through that as they are investigating and exploring. Um, one really big thing about the Walker Learning is relationships. So it's really about the teacher building that relationship with the students so that they feel supportive and loved and they can feel free to just explore and create things that they want to do and just really build on their learning. So we start off with the tune in and that's just going through um, our learning intentions that we're wanting to focus on through our investigations. And then that leads into investigation time. So that's where the kids will spend up to about 40 to 45 minutes of investigating around the room. So they choose from about eight different stations, whether that be craft, construction, um, tinkering area, it could be an outdoor kitchen or a home, cor home corner setting, you name it. It's what they are wanting to do around the room, they get to choose um, where they want to go and investigate. They may choose to go visit all of the areas or they may just want to stay at that one because that's what they love doing. So while the kids are being busy little bees around the room, the teacher is going around and spending that time with those focused children for that day. Um, and from that, the teacher is building those relationships with them. They're finding out what that child loves and enjoys. And then from there, they will weave that learning through it later in the day. So after investigation times, we have a reflection time. So everybody comes back to the mat. And in reflection time, we hear back from our focus children. And then from there, our reporter and photographer report back on their little task, which is, not, which is a um, link to their learning intentions. So that's how we bring the learning back through it. And we'll um, talk about what they did. They might teach the class a little job. And that will help us springboard into explicit teaching later in the day. 